I know that you fall in love with me, and it's hard, dog. You should be fighting my love and protecting your heart like a guard, dog. But you know that it's okay. I got your heart, I won't break. I got some more money, I went to the bank. You tryin' right away, you can't swim, so you saying You say you got choppers, you shootin' the blanks. Yo, what is going on, guys? Episode two is back. All right, before we hop into this game, let's see what our defensive coordinator has to say about our X-Factor running back. Hey, coach, what's the game plan for Derrick Henry? This guy's an absolute load. It's going to take two or three defenders to bring him down, especially if we give him the space to build up momentum. How do you want him to handle him? Err, neutralize him. We need to do everything in our power to shut him down. If fails, the entire Titans offense falls with him. Try to keep him down to 30. Okay. Set our season goal. Okay. I'm going to give ourselves seven wins. Looking with the schedule. Commit the goal for the year. Okay, we, ins we sign Malik. All right, now. Noah Fan is back on the squad. I went back through editing, and I figured out that we traded him. That was a bad mistake. We we got rid of a player, and we got also got Brandon Ayuk. So that's what I did there. Always. Also, Clavion Chase on. That's who I wanted. That's who I got. That's who I was talking about the other day. All right, that's going to be our starting corners. Er, and special teams, that's just going to be starting. All right. All right. Skip training. We're going to play for the offense only. Unless y'all... Actually, no. We're going to play the moments. We'll play the moments, actually. For this first game, we're going to play the moments. I usually just play on offense. I don't like playing defense because offense gets boring. Or defense gets boring. So that's why I do that. Let's hop into our first game against the Tennessee Titans with Derrick Henry, A.J. Brown, um, Ryan Tannehill. Like, look at that dude, dude. He's a base. I had Kevin Byard. I might try to trade it for him. I doubt they'd give me it, but, you know. A.J. Brown. All right. All right. We're inside the five. Jacob Eason comes up to under the center, snaps the ball, he hands it off to Philip Lindsay. And he runs up the middle for about a four-yard gain. Jacob Eason comes out for the pass. And he's got Jerry Judy for a first down. in the football here oh that was a scary pass so we got Jerry Judy inside for another first down all right Jerry okay Jacob Eason making some uh, adjustments at the line. And Philip Lindsay almost breaks away f for a first down. Gains about five yards on that play. All 
Thaddeus Moss for his first career reception as a Denver Bronco. Okay, calm down. Jerry Judy! What a great catch! For almost a first down, Jacob Easton making some uh, adjustments at the line. And it's a run up to Phillip Lindsay. Somehow, he shed the block instantly and tackled Phillip Lindsay. It's an empty back. It's an empty back set. Thaddeus Moss touchdown. Now, before y'all ask, we gonna do more options. We're just gonna play. I know I said I was gonna play the moments, but I'm just gonna play offense. Unless y'all want to see offense. Or defense. Now we're going to go to settings. I'm going to get this question. I can see it. It's all Madden. So. Sorry. Cortland Sutton. Cortland Sutton burning and trying to get around there. But Kevin Byard with a great tackle. Except Kurt, Cortland Sutton was already to the first down. Inside the 48, heading into Titans territory. Kevin Byard with a beautiful tackle. We're going to run out. The, uh, Jacob Eason is going to run a huddle. Or no huddle. He's going to hike the football. Jerry Judy! After this game, I'm going to change that gameplay or style or whatever to um, simulation, not arcade. That's probably why a lot of these animations are like that. But, uh, you know. Thaddeus Moss. Wide open again. A 21 yard reception. Philip Lindsay gets the handoff and he it trumbles on his own foot. Tumbles on his own foot, I guess. I don't know about all that. Quick fire. Cortland Sutton in for the in, into the end zone for a touchdown, but there's a f there's dirty laundry on the field. Pass interference, defense. All right, decline touchdown. All right, we have the ball in our own six. Like the football. Philip Lindsay gets a wide open lane and gets inside to the, about the 20, and that's the end of the first quarter. Apparently, our kicker missed a field goal. I don't know who our kicker is, but I do realize that he missed a field goal. Okay, D why did you stop? Keep on running. You would have had that burner. We're going to run that play back. Okay, I do see that little hiccup right there. All right. Brandon Ayuk. Jacob Easton so far on the day is 11 for 13, 187 yards. Two touchdowns thrown. Thaddeus Moss. Inside the 30. Looks like he was injured, but he got it back up. Jacob Eason. 
Oh! Who? Vinny... I don't know. I don't know that dude's name, but he dropped a wide open pick. He's rolling out to his little right. Throws it to Jerry Judy, and he almost stays inbound for the touchdown. Inside the 15. That's his fifth reception for 85 yards. Making adjustments at the line. He's got a wide open Thaddeus Moss. But he's incomplete. Batted out of the hands by the Titans. Thaddeus Moss with another touchdown. Thaddeus Moss. This is why I picked up Thaddeus Moss for me. Free agency. Incredible player. It is 20 to 0 in the first half. Jerry Judy almost catches that for a big break for the the Denver Broncos. Philip Lindsay rotating to the right. The wide receivers get in closer. Oh. Great run by Philip Lindsay up to the 36. Jacob Eason with the hike, rolling out to his right. He's, he sees Cortland Sutton beating his man and gets it in for a first down up to the 40. Jacob Eason's four, 15 for 20 so far. Hikes the football. Cortland Sutton beats the dude, and it's a touchdown. Cortland Sutton beats his man for a 40-yard touchdown. And the Denver Broncos, the score is 27-0. to I didn't say the score right away because I was afraid our kicker was going to miss again. But I don't think he's only missed one. He rolls out to the right, throws it, and he's got Cortland Sutton again for a first down. Jacob Eason finds Jerry Judy across the sideline up to the 26 for another Denver first down. Throwing, saying, setting hike. Brandon Ayuk almost picked off by the Tennessee Titans secondary. He's rolling out to his left. Sees Thaddeus Moss go up to challenge it. And it's Thaddeus for his third touchdown of the day. 34 to 0. Coming up to the first inning of the first half. Titans will go down the field and score. But Denver's back on the field. It looks like he's going to strike. Thaddeus Moss with the one hand grab. Okay, prior to this, I know this is not accurate. This is on not not simulation. It's on arcade, so this stuff is going to happen. But let's just enjoy it while it will, and then next episode, I'm going to get that fixed. Thaddeus Moss, find over the corner, and he... Did he get his toes in? Officials say he's not in bounds. Jacob Eason almost got that throw away. They're sending the house. <laughs> Yo, Jacob Eason, what an arm. But it was incomplete. 
It's fourth and ten. If we go for it and we get it, you know, we get to go down the field and kick a field goal or score a touchdown before. Inside the 10. All right, we got it. We're going to run some chew clock. Philip Lizzie with a nice run. Denver Broncos call a timeout. Brandon comes out on the field to kick the field goal, and it's up, and it is good. 37-7. to The Broncos are beating the Tennessee Titans by 30. <clears throat> Titans come down the field after, after the half and score a touchdown. Jerry Judy with the great catch on the sideline and then gets knocked out by Kenny Vaccaro. Vinny Vaccaro? Doe? I think. I don't know. Great catch by Jerry. Thaddeus Moss with the great catch for a check down route. Second and two. Uh, Ike. Corlin Sutton stays on his feet and gets inside the 30. Down in 10, Denver Broncos. Corlin Sutton breaks another tackle inside the 10. First and goal. Hikes the football, he rolls out to his right, and he sees Philip Lindsay leading his way into the end zone for a Denver touchdown. The Titans come down and score 21. They're not expecting the Hail Mary from the Denver Broncos. Did not catch it. Oh, incomplete, but bulldozes the middle linebacker. And he gets tackled behind the line of scrimmage. Eric Wilker, Wilkinson is down. As you see at the bottom, Patriots barely win that one against the Dolphins. The best punter. Boom. AJ Terrell on the uh, punt return. Absolutely lights out and gets the ball back. Jacob Eason running out. The AI misses the catch again. Uh, 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 no, we're going to substitute. Pretty much game over here. We're just gonna let the clock run out by them by itself. 
Uh, we're gonna super sim. We're just gonna jump to the next play. We're gonna jump forward to the end of the game. And the Denver Broncos win by 30. Good game. Gr lot, gra glad to see a lot of players improving like I thought they would. Thaddeus Moss, an incredible pickup for this team. Worked wonders. <clears throat> Jacob XD. Jacob Eason. Jacob Eason, 28 for 42. 556 yards. 66. Percent completion and seven touchdown passes. Incredible game. Now before this episode ends, I'm gonna update one thing. Jacob Eason gets an upgrade. We're gonna get we're gonna get field general an upgrade right there. Give him another upgrade. He's upgraded a 65 overall, and he's a rookie. Greedy Williams getting some upgrades along with a little bit of other players. We're gonna let the AI handle that. We're in advance to the next week. Breakout player. Let's see what we can do in the next. Greedy Williams. I can't speak for the rest of the defense, but man, last week was a game. I played this year. That does a huge thing for a guy's confidence, you know? Another game like last week, and man, I feel like I've arrived. Hold the Steelers to less than 200 passing yards. Okay. Alright, well, let's see the re weekly rewards awards real quick. Jacob Eason, the AFC Offensive Player of the Week. <sighs> let's see who, like, the uh, contract and negotiations are. Keanu O'Neal. Keanu O'Neal. He's 25 years old. I think we can get at least a couple, like, five more years out of him. We're going to offer that up to him. That's a good offer. I'm glad we've got the deal done. We have Keanu O'Neal. Justin Simmons, if we can. I'm going to sign him to about a three-year deal. Keep him until he's about 29 and then let him trade him or do something with him. Philip Lindsay, I may or may not keep. It's just depending on how it goes. Because if I don't keep him, I'm trying to get a running back for the draft. But, uh, other than that, that's game one. One more thing before I end this episode. Let's go up to simulation. That's there. All that's there. It has been your boy Siege FG, and this has been the Denver Broncos franchise, and I'm out. I gotta make it home so my mama don't cry I'd rather do this at this time or go by But the pain's so numb, I don't feel none Shooter still running around with no chill, but Still be towing in the town for the drill, son Let a nigga run up on me thinking I'm